Hello, I wanted to make you this little short video because there was a couple more things I wanted to cover. First of all, thank you for a great class today. I thought that was very informative. I love it when I learn new things and I think you guys learned a couple things too. So anyway, just to follow up, um, I am in Canvas right now and I wanted to show you a couple things that are going to be due and then a couple things you'll want to start working on with your company. So as you can see, I've got Canvas here and don't forget that you can actually shrink up some of your things so that they don't appear all the time <coughs> just an important little tip there okay so we've gotten through chapter four and um, one thing that you'll want to accomplish is this MIS chapter number four quiz however if you were in class then that should be an easy thing for you um, these are just based on the topics that were in chapter four which is what we covered okay so you will want to do that it's worth a hundred points which is not very much because the total points is only like 10% of your grade for all of the quizzes combined. So don't get too excited, but um, it just makes sure that you learn something. So there's that. Okay, so for the next thing, this DT, that's the disruptive technology companies that we've all formed now. A couple things we're gonna work on next week are creating a flyer and also creating a logo. So you VPs of marketing, this is kind of your ballywhack. And although the whole company is gonna wanna you know contribute to this so I'll get to that in just a moment um, a couple other things related to chapter 4 today is I've posted a couple um, virus things and some things on identity theft and there's some VPN stuff and then if you go to the videos I thought this might be good we didn't get to this today but here is a really good thing on employee monitoring and um, if you click on this it's a two minute YouTube video about um, somebody getting fired over a Facebook post which was really pretty innocuous but anyway so I wanted you to know that it really happens so that is there and then so let's see the things to do which are on our calendar which is also posted on canvas which looks something like this in case you haven't gotten yourself acquainted is that we're now here September 5th that was today so what have we got do we've got Excel module 3 project and exam now these aren't due till the 13th however since um, we're going to be moving on to the next thing and we're going to do a little activity you will, will have wanted to finish those things so um, that's what these are the exam is something you do at home the projects are what we're doing in class and the trainings are just to help you with both of those things so in terms of the disruptive technology there is a fun little website and I'm not going to load it because I already have it loaded um, that helps you create a logo if you want you do not have to use this but I thought it was kind of fun so you just enter uh, the name of your company this was my company all right so the ai logo is kind of what i use right so there's my name what type of business is it it's a computer uh online service we'll just call it that so it's technology business office you get the idea okay all right and then I can search some icons or I can skip this step. I can pick my color scheme. I can pick my font. And then the next thing that comes up is voila. Look at all of those cool fonts. All right, so you can use something like this. So you can use your own, you can create your own. I don't really care, but we will want to create a logo. That is something that you should be working on. All right, and then we're gonna create a flyer. And under this flyer thing, you can also see that Canva, that's probably my favorite one right there, but there's some other things that you can use to create a flyer. So the flyer's gonna obviously sell a customer, a potential customer on your product. So those are things that we're gonna be working on. Um, I would like you to be working on your logo before next class. All right, that's it. Have a great weekend and I'll see you next week.